I'm not yet dead, and welcome back to Shamrock Valley. So it's uh, a little bit after lunch. I finished liming the uh, field down at. Uh, remind me, never remember these numbers. Field 37. So field 37 is now limed. Rick go. He says, uh, all ploughed, all limed, all nice and clean. So we field 38. Uh, field 15. We are still waiting for the crops to dry up, but the temperature sits 7 degrees. It's 2 o'clock in the afternoon, it's supposed to get up to 8, so, I mean, fingers crossed, 3, 4 in the afternoon before it starts to get damp again, maybe? Uh, I mean, let's face it, if it ain't today, oh, not enough, if it ain't today, it ain't going to happen. Um, but that's just how it is, really. Uh, we'll just have to see what we do. If I need to, I'll just have to buy in either corn or just pig feed wholesale or something. Anyway, either way, we're coming down to field seven, going to uh, pick up these bales. Um, I'm sorry, I don't know how many there are in this field. There might be more than we can take, but we'll take as many as we can anyway. Oop. And uh, not overly worried about letting the sheep in it's not as any grass they're not like to come in here um right so try and do so i'm trying to try and do a bit more in cab if i can so let's get these bales picked up there's a couple down the bottom they're going to be a touch tricky actually we'll just do a run around the field I need to change direction Yeah, we'll get these down the old biogas plant. Um, it'll give us some more uh, digestate by tomorrow. I might yet anyway do some of, um, the, f of the field. 27, was it? The potato field. Um, might do some of that today anyway, just in case. Uh, I can always slurry it in the spring. doesn't really matter, but it'd be nice to get some of it done. I still need to look at my rotations, actually. Figure out what I'm going to do where. Perhaps we'll do that in a minute as well, but uh, yeah. Otherwise, I mean, to be honest, wait, apart from waiting for the thing, the, the, the feed of the pigs get a bit low, we'll probably have to feed them again. Need to think about um, starting to move some of the pigs. Actually, they're getting a little bit too many down at the main pig farm. Bring to bring some up. Figure out which ones we're going to keep for breeding bring the rest up here to the other unit, the other pig sty, and then we can start getting them settled in. I need a new water container because obviously I've taken the old one for the cows and the sheep down to um, the pig farm, so I need to sort that out at some point. Right, let's reverse the oat and uh, get these next to the fence. Spin this round. Here we go. Should be alright to get all these. Those two are really close to the fence, but I think we should be able to get it right if we judge it just right. Is that a train I can see? No. I thought I could see a train coming. Right, and let's watch this very, very carefully. Don't want to be a little bit further over. But not that far over. Okay. There we go, that's one. It's back out there. So is that that's fifteen. Another nine. There we go. So let's see, oh yes, uh, definitely going to need another trip around this field. Oh, missed that one. 
Oh no, it got it. Another one somewhere. Where is it? Oh, there it is. There it goes. Right. Well, I'll just pick up um, a few more and um, maybe uh, see you down at the biogas plant in a little while. Crikey. It's good about whoa, 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 whoa. Steady. Got it, got it, got it. Another four. And I'll see you down the biogas. How many are we going to have left then? So quick peek. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are eight left on the field. So right, so there'll be four left. Okay. So what's that? Twenty-four times four. So what's that? Ninety ninety-two thousand litres? Ooh, ninety-two thousand litres. Wowzers, uh, let's see, mind you, price not be quite as good as it is for, uh, ah, it's still 450 per 1,000 litres. It's not, not, not to be sniffed at. And we've still got the bales from the other field as well. There aren't quite as many, it's not quite such a big field. Can I get these sneak in? Yeah, just about. Mind you, I need one of them. Right, there we go, we're done. Right, let's get these down to the biogas plant then. Right, here we are. There's our perfectly limed field. Beautifully white. At least it will be until it gets slurried and then it'll be beautifully brown. Get this wide right, okay. might be easier to do this of course what I haven't done yet is check I mean they ought to be alright I'm sure it have been two days now round bail 24 excellent should have checked them before I put them in I'm sure they'll be fine right it's been a cut has been a couple of days since I did that field. So it should be absolutely fine. Right. Oh no, wrong button. That's the one we wanted. Turning away nicely. Sadly, of course, they may not all fit. Now I can check them. It's going to cost me. Yep, silence, perfect. Interesting, that's going to stay at 50,000 until one of those bales goes. Uh, okay, right, note to self, that was too many bales. There they go. Just come up the edge here, there's one gone already. <laughs> that's quite cool. Anyway, right, I'll leave that there. I will go feed the pigs. And uh, hmm, we'll come back and tidy up in a bit. Ooh, that's a bit loud. So I've realised that you've seen me do this before, but I just realised something. Well, I've realised two things, actually, both of which are slightly silly. So I've done, given the pigs their water, uh, as you can see, I'm just giving them some straw, uh, which actually, how's that doing? Okay. Do you know what? No, no, it's fine. Let's put it in the thing. Um, but I just realised something. You see that great big white thing over there? Just, you know, just on the other side of the pigsty. I've just realised what that is. It's a lime silo. So all that toing and froing I did yesterday was completely, totally and utterly unnecessary. 
which is, you know, a little bit frustrating. But there you go. I just thought I'd share that with you. I'm feeling a bit silly, really. Uh, plus, the other thing I'm also feeling slightly silly about is that because um, I used the the, uh, the little Massive Oberson three-ton trailer to bring the um, pallets down, I had to reconfigure it at the workshop at the store uh, to do so. And um, I don't have a workshop down here, so um, or even a toolbox. So I've no way of um, changing it back to being a tipper from being a flatbed trailer. So uh, I need to take that back up to the yard or else get myself a toolbox down here, which actually might be the better solution. So I can't feed the pigs right now. Not that they're urgent, desperate, you know, but still. So we may as well just finish this bit off. What I'm going to do actually, now that I've got the slurry tank down here, um, and we've got, uh, uh, you know, we've got that to, to spread slurry. Uh, originally, my thinking was that I wouldn't produce enough manure from just one animal set, so I thought I'd do straw at both. But actually, I realised, of course, if I don't use straw down here, then the pigs could just produce slurry. So I'm going to do that. Um, I'll uh, I'll just use up what straw there is, uh, leave them to finish the manure. The manure I'll sell at the um, uh, at the biogas plant next door, which of course is our next port of call, um, and uh, and then I'll even produce slurry, and then I can be producing my own slurry, and I could either, whoops, wrong way, no, 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 don't come out. There's a chap. Actually, come on, that's better. I squeeze it in, will it just sort of settle in a bit? Yeah, it's better than it was. Um, yeah, so. Um, yeah, so I could do that. So I could either then sell the slurry at the biogas plant and still get digestate, or just use the slurry direct. Either way works. That doesn't really work because uh, I've now got both being used. That's better. See what I'm doing, right? And also means that uh, lower that down. There we go. So yeah, once I've, um, I'll leave the bag. I might get another one of these grab things, actually. They're quite cool, aren't they? Um, yeah, it also means that actually once I've cleaned out the manure for the last time and there's no more manure, um, I no longer need the bale forks. I no longer need a um, bucket down here. I'll let the trailer out, which is fine. I'll need to do something with it. Either whiz it up to the store or get a toolbox and manipulate it. So yeah, um, I'll leave this down here for now. Uh, yeah, I won't need the um, the bucket or the the fork anymore down here. Uh, I've got the broom for clearing out, um, so I will sadly actually, because I've had it for a while, um, get rid of the little skid steer. Anyway, that's all I can do here for now. As you can see, still waiting for the crops to dry out. It's not looking good. I am not holding out much hope. Of course, it's winter, so it's already starting to get dark. The combine is just sat there just on the off chance. I'm not feeling overly optimistic. The evening is drawing in. We'll eke out the last little bits of daylight that we possibly can just to get a few more jobs done. Hopefully by now. Yeah, that's not actually really. That's still processing. Oh, so it is. All right. OK. But still. Just joyride in the uh, in the biogas plant a minute. I could just go get the bell fork to be honest. Maybe I'll do that. Just bring the skid steer over with its bell fork on. And uh, actually just spear them and put them in. That could be the way to do it. Ah, sorted. Because now we've got bales, and if we've got bales, it will unload. And if it will unload, we can do this. 
Ooh, except curiously they're not real bales and therefore they sort of... Oh, no, they've exploded out. Oh well. Better than nothing. Oh, 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 there we go. Well done. Very good job. Right. Whew, well that was a bit messier than it could have been. Uh, but there you go. Well, I'll leave that there. So go grab some more, shall we? Actually, what's the weather forecast for tomorrow? We're going to have frozen ground. Uh, mm, we are forecast snow. Oh. Oh. Yeah, the ground's not completely frozen, actually. But we are forecast snow. Or sleet, or something. Something unpleasant coming out of the sky, anyway. excitement I was just about to go and get a cultivator and start cultivating some of the fields I've, I loaded up the trailer as you saw I've just left that at the farm for now uh, the biogas plant doesn't have the capacity really to um, process many more bales overnight so I thought well I'll leave them but I just noticed so we're in a rush crops are dry finally it's four o'clock in the afternoon probably in the last chance I could have and the crops are dry so we have quick as a flash run down to the cornfield I didn't even bring a trailer didn't even stop to think about it I just dashed down here I may not even need a trailer I don't know I've, actually we probably will there's more corn in here than this little combine can cope with but I thought well you know at some point it's going to start getting damp again so not a moment, and I mean literally a moment to lose. At least we can get some of the crop in it via start. Plus, it means I weren't a complete waste of our money. Well, it's a dinner anyway, because I need that for the sunflowers, I guess. But yeah, I was just trying to figure out crop rotations. Hurrah! Quick as a flash. What are you talking about buying that field? It's been fallow all year, so quite nice to have that one, and also maybe one over the river. I'll see if there's any available, just to you know explore a different part of the region. And it's a bit daft. I, I normally, like I say, generally tend to buy my fields around the farm and build outwards. But the reality is that means that there'll be bits of the map that I'll never get to see. definitely should have got a trailer um, well I guess this needs to get the pig farm so actually what I could do very quickly is go grab the trailer take it back up to the store of the yard get it reconfigured to oh no that's just faffy it's not worth it 
Uh, yeah, no, it's fine. I'll go get the Marshall trailer. I need a quick wash out because I used it for manure last. Oh, I'm so happy. We're actually getting some corn. This is brilliant. So exciting. I really didn't think this was going to happen. thought I was going to have to be buying in uh, pig food. But we need to be quick, we need to keep on it. There's every chance that at some point the crop will get too wet again. It's four o'clock in the afternoon, first day of winter. You know, it's pretty likely at some point it's going to say, no, 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 sorry. The dew is hitting too damp and it's literally just dry out literally I was just looking, I was just looking at crop rotations thinking okay which fields do I want to cultivate which do I not let's go get a cultivator and start cultivating a field while the ground's not frozen and uh, yeah but crops take precedence 100 percent So yeah, I'm going to have to figure out how I best get get a trailer. Um, yeah, I may just nip up and get the marshal, give it a quick jet wash out, and bring it back down. Because actually we're getting a fair amount off here. Oh, whoops, sorry. Paying attention. Not to mention, actually, I should think about the fact that I should probably have some up at the main yard as well, uh, just because, you know, at some point soon I'll be moving the pigs into the new pig unit. Oh, that was clearly a bad point at which I should start a helper. Um, yeah, I'll need to be using, moving some pigs up to the new pig sty, and uh, therefore. be needing some up at the main silo. Okay, I'll need to tie it up. Wow, which way is he going? Oh, oh well, whatever. Anyway, I haven't got time to grumble. There's a few more weeds in here than I might have liked, but at one point I really didn't even know if the crops were going to grow, let alone let's get it to harvest. Where's the... Oh, wrong way, missed it. Tractor's here. Sorry, it's getting a bit dark. Healthy, he's got a full grain tank. Quick, 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 quick. Right. Let's get a trailer. I've literally just had the helper has a full grain tank notification. Ugh, how am I going to get to him though? I have to bring the combine out. And I was just on the way back. So that was almost, almost perfect timing. Right, let's see. I made myself enough space to squeeze around the edge of the field. Just about. Right, if I just move this over here very carefully. Oh, 
Hurrah! Brilliant. First corn going in. It's not a bad size field, so we're going to get a pretty reasonable yield off this. All those pigs that need fattening up, so it's good. Give them, make them grow. Not of course the widest header in the world, but well, certainly the biggest this combine could have coped with. It's fine. Fingers crossed. We'll just keep chugging away. I don't know how much of it we'll manage to get in in the end, um, but uh, yeah, we'll do what we can. It's all we can do. We are dependent on the weather. It's just how it is. Oh, but that's good. God, I've been worried about this. I'm being far too optimistic as to how much we're going to harvest in one go, one pass, aren't I? Way too optimistic. Anyway, light's fading, but we'll keep going as long as we can. Try and get as much of this crop in before the dampness hits and on that point let's uh, begin to ignore the little bits and go for the you know most efficient way but yeah I'll keep working on uh, we'll get as much of this in as we can I mean it's now quarter past four it's starting to get a little bit dark um, a lovely evening mind you But yeah, so um, finally the corn is in, or some of it at least so far. We'll just see how long it stays dry before it starts to get too damp again. But um, ah, fingers crossed. Anyway, ah, I hope you've enjoyed it. If you did, likes and subscriptions are very much appreciated. And uh, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow morning on what promises to be actually potentially quite a wet and snowy day um, and uh, but at least by then we'll have got this in or at least a lot of it and we'll see what we can do I'll see you then looking forward to it bye for now